Hi folks, today we are going to have a very important video because I will dig into a new Sony product announcement, quite a big announcement coming very soon. I have the date of the announcement, I have very likely the list of products that will be announced on that day and I will dig into all that soon but please before that take two seconds time to subscribe to the channel, hit the notification button if you don't want to miss any of my upcoming videos. So folks, it's going to be very busy on this channel and on sonyofrumos.com because Sony is going really full in on full frame and I can share some details I got from trusted sources so there's a really high chance that what I'm telling you today is going to be correct. First of all, uh, Sony will have a major product announcement on August the 29th. Uh, depending on your time zone it might be different the day before day later I don't know if you live in Asia or USA but anyway what I've been told is that August 29, 29 is the a date of the major Sony product announcements and um, I'm still not 100% sure about all the products that will be announced on that day but I will give you um, my take on uh, what's very likely to be announced. I really think at the end we will get three new products on that day. The first one is the A7C2. I think there's a 99% chance we will get this camera on August 29. Uh, the specs are easy because it's basically the a7 IV in a different uh, body form factor so uh, same that 33 megapixel sensor 4k 60p and so forth I've been told it has some additional features like for example AI uh, built in in the camera so the dedicated processor something the a7 IV uh, doesn't have like the a7 C2 will have. I didn't get other specs like the AVF which are for me very important for a rangefinder kind of style of camera. I still don't know what the resolution of the AVF will be. Maybe it will use the same one of the a7 IV and I hope to get specs about the camera soon. I have an unconfirmed info that the a7 C2 will be priced slightly above $2,000 but I'm not 100% sure yet about that. The second product that will be announced is very likely to be the A7CR. I'm 90% sure that this camera will be announced along the A7C2. The A7CR will have basically the same form factor as the A7C2 and just have a different sensor. I'm still not 100% sure, but I think it will use the same A7R5 sensor which means 61 megapixel and I don't have info about the pricing of the camera but I guess it will be priced slightly above the A7C2 and this would be the second camera announced on August the 29th and the third product that will be announced on August the 29th I give it a 85% chance that it will be the 1635 GM2 lens which is a lens we expected already since a long time because Sony is updating all the GM zoom and prime lenses that are uh, very old like five plus years old the 1635 GM the original one is outdated so the new lens will be more compact have uh, improved autofocus improved optical uh, quality it will be a very exciting lens uh, because it's a kind of lens that many of us do like to own and shoot with so uh, I'm really happy that Sony will announce this I don't have info about any possible other new product um, I heard something about a possible new accessory, so this might be coming, but it doesn't sound like we are getting another lens. So if you're waiting like me for the 85 1.2 GM, uh, that's more likely to be announced sometimes in autumn. I heard that there will be more announcements from Sony in autumn, so uh, this isn't going to be the last announcement of the year. There will be something else. I'm still not sure if the A93 will make it uh, in late 23 as an announcement. Um, it's just on the verge, it might be, but the A93 is definitely on the roadmap and it will have a wonderful new stack sensor, so I'm very uh, curious about how that camera will be. To wrap it up, Sony will have a major announcement on August 29th and likely will get those three products, the A7C2, the A7CR and the 1635 2.8 GM2. And as soon as I have more info like detailed specs, uh, pricing info or even images hopefully, I will make a new video so please again subscribe, you can count, count on me being the, always the first to share new rumors about Sony so uh, it would 
mean a lot to me if you uh, keep following me, if you're interested in that gear. And also if you would like this video just, you know, to uh, cheat a bit on the YouTube algorithm so that um, I somehow get visibility because I know by a fact that after I post a video a couple of hours later, everyone else is copying the info <laughs> I posted and they have many more followers. So they get on top and me, I stay on the bottom. I would like to be somehow uh, appreciated, but, but by the work I do. And uh, that's it. Uh, see you soon, folks, for my next video about the possible Sony A7C2, A7CR and 1635 Gem 2 specs and hopefully images. Bye!